It's 83 degrees outside and I am wearing a sweatshirt. I'm just gonna rock a sweatshirt because I wanna be comfy for my morning coffee and for the rest of the day because I have to do laundry. I'm gonna come back and cook breakfast. Christian and I have been thinking about what we had for breakfast yesterday. And I just wonder why I didn't try it sooner. Never. It never even crossed my mind until the other day. But you guys should definitely try it. It's so good. So I'm gonna come back after um, I get coffee and cook breakfast. My hair's a little crazy today, but I hope you guys are having a good day. It's Mother's Day. I'm just trying to do things that bring me joy, like trying new coffee shops and going to get coffee and doing stuff like that. I mean, my mom isn't around and I'm not gonna get into that, but um, if you are dealing with losing a parent and their birthday comes around, the day of their passing comes around, Mother's Day, Father's Day, whatever it may be comes around, really focus on doing things that bring you so much joy that day and because that's at the end of the day what they would want you to do so that's what i'm doing i'm going to get coffee and we're gonna have a great day and we're gonna enjoy ourselves i'm gonna come back and cook that really good breakfast and um wash my bed sheets and stuff like that those are like little things that make me happy and then i think christian and i are gonna cook steaks for dinner so it's just gonna be like a really good day maybe i'll go on a walk or take a bath or do other types of things that make me feel my best and i need to pull up where this place is because i really don't know i'm so excited to go to this place i think i want to try something unique and different so Do you see this? This is insane. Oh my gosh. Okay. I don't think this lighting is it. So, I just got out of the coffee shop and I filmed like for a second in there. If you live in the Orlando area, this is called Create Coffee. And so I got their Exotic Joe, which is, it's a latte and it's a brown sugar topped with espresso and it has oat milk in it. And then I also got a dirty matcha, which is matcha with oat milk and espresso shot. Cause I couldn't decide between them. So I decided to get two and they're both for me. Treat yourself people. I probably won't finish both of them, but um, at least I get to try both. You know? I'm gonna try this first. Oh, I love their ice. Wow. It kind of tastes like a version of the brown sugar shaken espresso from Starbucks, but not as light and sugary. It's more of like a medium roast, not a blonde roast, but still like light. This is really good. Okay, now let's try the dirty matcha. It's good. So the matcha doesn't come sweetened and I didn't get any sweetener in it at all. And it's good. I mean, I like matcha. I feel like matcha is definitely an acquired taste. So, but that's good. I'm loving it. I'm so happy that I went. So happy that I went. But this one, so good. I spilled like the coffee. I had them sitting down there for a picture and I went to go turn because the lighting is better over here and I went to go like move my car from my spot that I parked in and they just and I my reflexes are really fast and very lucky because I've been very sad I mean I would have just gone in and got more but we did not need to spend $30 on coffee today 15 is enough but anyways um I'm gonna go home now I wish there was more forward light from my cabinet, but there's not. I'm just chopping up some avocado for breakfast. Um, 
Chris and I are obsessed with that dish that I made yesterday. So I'm making it again. Hash browns are in the air fryer and I wait to cook the eggs till the last minute. So that way they're like warm on top and they take literally a second in the pan because they're like runny eggs. So if you cook the Trader Joe's hash browns in the air fryer, they come out so crispy, like 400 for like 10 or 12 minutes. They're so crispy and good. And I'm gonna mix, I might have to do two avocado. I'll just do two, I'd rather have more than not enough. And I have you over here because my air fryer is so loud and if I have you in that cabinet. Grandma Anita. Happy Mother's Day. Thank you, thank you. found some scooters i think they got rid of i think they got rid of all of the bikes that they have around lake baldwin um which is a big lake close to where we live and um we have ridden bikes around the lake before but i think they got rid of those bikes that you just scan and go so all they have is scooters so i think we're gonna take some scooters around the lake i wish it was some form of exercise but it's not so we found some scooters and the lake's just a few blocks over. We're gonna go ride the scooters around and be out in the sun for a little. to do with one hand but this is the lake i don't know if you can see it through the trees this is so hard i feel like i can't hit a bunch of it i don't want to fly into someone honey can we go so can we go faster you can go faster yeah, i'm just gonna go faster than you how are you like so adventurous you want to go on all these rides and all this shit? <laughs> i don't want to go fast on these and then you want to like on water slides and it's jet skis and all that. This is so hard with one hand. It's hard to multitask. I can't ring the bell and go and hold the camera all at the same time. <laughs> living my best life. You want slow coke? I'm not slow. I'm gonna ride this into the lake. No, you're not. <laughs> no, thank you. You guys enjoy another good day, okay? So I just got out of the shower. I threw on a same sweatshirt that I was wearing earlier because I really just didn't like do much in it. And then I threw on the matching sweatpants for it. I'm about to do a face mask. I want to do this Dr. Jart one. Okay, so I'm going to put on this. It's bright and brightening one I think is really good they're expensive though 
so. Okay. I don't even look like myself. Honestly, I don't even look like myself. So I'm gonna wear this. I can't even take myself seriously. I'm gonna wear this for 40 minutes. I'm gonna do this. I don't even look like myself. Like, this doesn't even look like me. We're starting to make dinner and Christian wanted a big salad, which actually sounds really good. So we both um, threw together this salad with romaine. Some of this kale we threw in some of the salad kit we left the toppings and the dressing out some red onion tomatoes cucumber and we're gonna use this dressing doesn't this look so good a glass of the rock angel thing. We're cooking steaks for dinner. Mine is really small, but Trader Joe's steaks are really good. And we're also cooking some asparagus and we're also having the gorgonzola gnocchi. I feel like this is what we always do with steak. We could switch it up and do potatoes, but I feel like this doesn't go well with anything else other than steak, so. Christian and I went to the store today and we got some of these. I tried to try this literally probably a year and a half ago before Christian and I lived together and he lived with roommates and I left a bag of them in his fridge at his old apartment and him and his roommates ate them. So I never tried them. So I'm making three and I'm gonna save these. I'm not gonna cook them all and then if I want some next weekend, I can just make them really quick. I mean, you can't go wrong with chocolate chip. So tons of people have tried these. They're just kind of have better ingredients than regular cookies. And is it Lauren or is it Lauren? Because if it's Lauren, it's a great name. <laughs> they don't look like regular cookies. That's the only thing. I mean, I guess the bottom does. Not <laughs> the top. Oh my gosh, I have a, I have a solution for these plates. Is this the appetizer plate? There's no way. I'm so confused. I should have measured, I guess. That's on me, but I guess these are the appetizer plates? I don't know what I would put on this. This is kind of like a fail on my part. Oh, we love it. Wow. You know, who says that these plates were not meant for anything? They're cookie plates. I'm so glad I didn't return these. I'm gonna go hand this to Christian. He's gonna laugh. I do look a little rough. I think I'm really tired, but these cookies, I've been missing out. They're so good. It tastes like a normal cookie, literally. Literally, so good. Okay, um, I am about to, I don't know if Krish and I are gonna watch a movie or not, but I wanted to end off this vlog. I've been so bad about ending off videos. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you guys are having a great day or night, depending on when you're watching this. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you in my next one, bye.